On last week, the Maharashtra police gunned down six alleged Naxalite women in an encounter in Gachiroli. Rashmi Rajput travels to the Red Belt and finds that women revolutionaries often have little choice but to join the movement and little hope of a normal life, even if they choose to give up arms. Gachiroli, the heart of the Naxal struggle in Maharashtra, which battles every other day between Maoists and police to dominate the dense forested area. In the 80s, young and old Gon tribals, men and women, swept in by the Maoist ideology. For the men, the attraction living the life of a revolutionary. For the women, the choice stark, with fathers and brothers away from home, acute poverty bred a sense of insecurity. 21-year-old Lalita lives with 33 other surrendered Maoists at this state rehab center. Her husband, a local Dalam leader, surrendered to the Chhattisgarh police last year, leaving Lalita no option. Here too, Lalita feels cheated. She says, once the police gets all the information from them, they are asked to leave. Surrender is not the only strategy to. Of course, this problem will take some more time. It, it cannot be solved in a day or two or a year or two. In Katchuruli district with camera person Dinesh Harale, Rashmi Rajput for News First at 10.